welcome to Aurora Public Library's Take and Make Kit. We have, this week we have the two peas in a pod necklace. So this is what you're going to get in your kit. You're going to get two paint pots. You are going to get some wire, a chain, two wooden beads, some felt, and two jump rings. So this one is very fun and different. Um, first thing you're going to do is paint your wood bead. So um, I would recommend green, which is why we've given you blue and yellow paint colors, but you can uh, use whatever you like. You can do one blue, one yellow, one green, both green, whatever you like. For the sake of time, I've got two that I've already painted green here, and we'll get going. So I'm gonna put the two painted wooden beads on the wire and just gonna kind of bend that around. What I want is for the, the beads to sort of sit right up against each other. And then I want the jump rings on each side of the wire, like that. And then I'm just gonna bend the wire. Oops, sorry, before I do that, I'm going to uh, take the end of the jump ring and I'm going to use two small sets of pliers and open that jump ring and attach the chain before I bend the wire back. Okay, just twist that apart and thread that onto one side of the chain here. And then just bend, oops, bend that jump ring back. And it fell off. That's okay. And then do the same thing to the other side. And it doesn't matter if you put the jump ring on the chain before you put it on the wire. Not a big deal. And do the same thing with this side. Okay, close that jump ring up again. Okay, so now I've got the jump rings attached to the chain, attached to the wire, attached to the beads. So now that I've got the chain on, I'm going to bend the wire back like that. And then the next part, I keep losing my ring here. So the next part is um, you can draw two little faces on your pea pods if you like. You can get as fancy as you like with this. You can give them hair. I'm gonna make one happy and one sad, just for fun. Okay. Then, now here is a part where uh, having scissors and a hot glue gun is going to come in very handy. So if you've got those things, I would recommend using them. What I'm gonna do is, Just set these guys right in the middle of the felt and kind of fold it over. And then I'm going to cut two ends off just so that it looks a little bit more like an actual pea pod. Okay, so I've trimmed that and I've got some hot glue here. Okay. I'm 
do the same thing on the other side. Almost looks like a little green canoe. You could also use super glue, it would just take a little bit longer to dry. Okay, and the second thing I'm going to do is put a little bit of hot glue on the very bottom of that pea pod, and then I'm going to stick the, um, the little guys in the bottom so that they stay in one place. So it'll look like that, they'll just be pushed down a little bit more. And before I do that, I'm going to make sure that the chain, oops, jump ring fell off too. I'm going to make sure that the chain sits on the bottom and hasn't come off of the wire. Okay, so I'm just going to put a little bit of glue in the very bottom here. And then as carefully as I can, put these guys with the wire at the back, sort of on the very bottom of that pea pod. sort of nestle them in there in the hot glue before it sets. And there you have it, your two peas in a pod necklace.